everyone, and welcome back to the Were Witch Project. Today's video is episode 4 of our V Rising full release series. I'm Were Witch, and this is my co host, Harry. Hello, everybody. Harry here. I just wanted to thank all of our amazing viewers for the comments, sympathy cards, flowers, chocolates, and well wishes. I'm doing much better since our last episode. I'm getting back out there, and I've even taken up some new hobbies. Model race cars, guitar, gardening, uh, unicycling, uh, eyebrow threading, synchronized swimming, uh, uh, ice sculpting. While that is a large, varied, and strangely detailed list of things we didn't need to know, it's not the time, man. We need to do the intro. Uh, right. Well, in this episode, Witch, Gamma, and Blair drink blood and dodge sunbeams. Wow. Thanks, Harry. Very descriptive. Let's get to the episode. I think I'm going the right way. Um, I think that's where... whereabouts my... Sniffer's telling me. How's everybody's blood? I'm okay. I have full I had to eat after the fish... Fisherman. 90% rogue over here. Can we skip this camp and pick her up on the way back? Yeah. Oops. Come on, Sant. Are you telling me it's the other direction? Yeah, that's why I stopped. I feel like something's wrong. I think it's this way. Yep, my man. Yep, that's it. Oh. That is definitely it. Okay, but it where were nice. we? We came across a bridge. I don't know. We'll figure it out on the way back. We should definitely wait until nightfall. Mm -hmm. This one's awful. Wicked fire starter. I'm the trouble starter, pumpkin instigator. Nice, Harry. Yep, this V Blood's name is Clive the Firestarter. He uses lots of explosions or bomb based fire attacks. I'm the fear addicted, he the danger illustrated. Okay, man, that's enough. Nice singing voice. Oh, thank you. M my voice is on point, right? I've been doing some uh, vocals lately. Singing? Is this another new hobby? Yeah, one of my many talents I've picked up recently. Well, it's good to see you working on yourself. Must be tough, man. W what do you mean, tough? Uh, I'm just saying it can't be easy for individuals such as yourself to meet. It's not like there's a dating site for monsters. Human impaired. Okay, it's not like there's a dating site for the human impaired. Wait. There's a dating site for monsters? What's it called? Uh, it's called Slither. Okay, Slither, like Tinder. Uh, I get it. Well done. I fell for it. Fell for what? The site is called Slither. Slither. Do I want a shield for this fight? Uh, lots of explosions on the ground. I don't know if it will work properly. Lots of explosions everywhere, for that matter. <laughs> Big booms. Fifty-eight warrior. I would love to try to eat that thing. If we could. Up real nice. Aggro. I'm gonna eat that. Oh. 
73 over here. If somebody oh. wants her. I'm fine. She's dead. Way too no problem. Get in an awful spot back yeah. there. Yeah, I can't even get to you to help you. Oh no no! I... Like it was okay for a second, <laughs> and then it wasn't. Trying to take out oh, all these shoot. ads, we just yeah, keep I getting know. so fucking many. And I don't know if it matters. We can just take him out and get on him. Everybody, move close. He's going down. Get here. Yes, that's my get Everybody right on. Here. Mm -hmm. Good grief. That was just non-stop. Yeah, yeah. It, we didn't get a chance to clear anything, uh -uh. so every time... Because you have to kite him, because yeah. he just ex explodes the entire ground, or covers it. What'd we get from him? Minor explosives, alchemy table, and a chaos point. Uh, let's get the sulfur while we're here. Is that it? It seemed really light. That was it. What the fuck? Okay, so we need to find, um... Whatever that camp was. I think it was probably like right here ish. I remember she was an archer and that was about Be it. my guess. <laughs> yeah, right there, ninety rogue. That'd be a good start for our army, if you guys think yeah, so. I'm back mm -hmm. up so that I don't got ads coming from yeah let's the handle right. them first let them come to us we'll drop them and then we'll move in on her if she gets uh involved in the group or whatever just be real mindful open her. another group to the right going that direction yeah and she's got a friend that's with her as well so what you want to do is you want to have them at 30 percent or damn near close to 30 percent so about right there as you can see you are in my grasp that should pop her Got her. Bend to my will. Okay. So we've got an issue. We've got a really long way to go. And okay. she could get killed. I'm going to move over here just to be safe. There's somebody coming across the bridge. If you guys can cut them off, please. The mace is so cool when, like, it... When I get it to land right. <laughs> oh, dude, I love the mace. It's awesome. I agree. All right, so if you guys can see my pinpoint, you'll know what path I'm taking. Okay, let me... Um... All right, I just pinned it as well so that I can also see that.
And what's crazy too is I agree with that path. Mm-hmm. Like like that is the yeah. that's exactly there the is way. There's a bear here. Yep. I'm going to hang back until you guys tell me it's safe. I I can see from here. He wasn't aggroed on us because we were wolves. <laughs> this rogue will seriously be a great start. Do a pause here. Yeah. Got a group passing to our left. Think we're good now? Yep. I was just checking to see if they had if they were worth eating or taking. Got wolves up here. I'm gonna get back. There's another pack. Moving in from the northwest. You guys are already on them. There's more. more. Oh, that's a high level wolf. High blood. Ah, tried to snag. Oh, that's a 93, 93 creature. Yeah, yeah, dude. I got him. That's, that's a barely. really good blood. Cre creature blood's not bad. <sighs> Anything that's 93 is not bad. Oh, sorry, I didn't realize you had... One left. Looks like they're pathing away. Yeah. Now. Nope, backing up. Yep. I saw that chaos volley flare. What? Just good. It's a good shot. How's our pizza timer? Oh, it's burnt as fuck. I'm kidding. I got it out. In the middle of the Clive fight, when I said I'm gonna go hide for a second. <laughs> oh, okay. Plant. Yep. And sun. Oh, I'm sorry. We're hiding behind a tree over here. Uh, incoming. We've got a 97 brute over here. Coming back. We can come back for it or we can grab it now. It's whatever. We can come back. They'll be there. Then we can methodically, surgically okay. remove it. Yeah, it's daytime and we already have this guy we're trying to protect, so... You think there'd be a better uh, or, or an easier way to get subdued servants back to the castle? Well, there is, Harry. Thanks for bringing it up. In V Rising, there is a system in place in which you can dominate NPCs to become servants. Obtaining these NPCs in differing territories grants you bonuses when sending them out on correlating territory missions. There's rogues, brutes, warriors, workers, workers slash creature, werewolves, scholars, and now with the full release of V Rising, the elusive and possibly hard to obtain Draculin. They all have differing blood types and percentages with the higher percentages yielding better attributes as you go up in tiers. You can even keep those higher bloods imprisoned in your castle to drink later at your leisure. At level 44 gear score, once you down Vincent the Frostbringer, you'll earn the ability to make those prisons. We'll show you this in later episodes of the series. After the player defeats Leandra the Shadow Priestess at level 47 gear score, you unlock the ability to create Dust Callers. These player crafted items allow you to quickly and safely transfer newly subdued NPCs across the world of Vardaron into your closest castle's vacant prison. 
This helps to avoid those pesky fire archer rogues who want to burn the world down just to kill you and your newly turned NPC. I've lost a couple high bloods in my days to those guys. Dust callers can help to alleviate this issue. Level 44? Uh, level 47? Uh, I, I just call him a puba. A what? Please don't repeat that. What? Puba? It's the name of the taxi service I use. Have a nice slither date. Do your business. Y you know, call him a puba. What? A puba. You gonna eat him? No, yeah. no, no, I can't. No, I'm... I'm uh, trying, I'm in a, I'm in a freaking bubble. <laughs> as soon as I can get him. Working on the ads for you. Yeah, I'm eating. Put me in an egg. I saw that, <laughs> that he wound you up. We're so close. Baby deer. It's coming right for us. Here, we're here. Oh, and then we'll all need to interact with it. Uh, once it's in the coffin for the quest. Do I have enough? Oh yeah, we just have to interact with the servant once. Mm -hmm. Um, they're converted. You will find I'll be right back. In service. Um, I think it would be a good idea very soon to head up north and grab some horses and get some water skins on them. Even if they're shitty horses so that we can start moving faster than uh, what we're currently moving. I think that would be beneficial.
back. Huzzah! Uh, did you build an alchemy bench yet? Uh, I did not personally. Okay. I will do that. I'm gonna go get that brute real fast. Uh, I've got a horse. Come on. Thoughts are mine to burn. You are under my command. Water skin spilled for the horses. Yes. Bend to my will. <clears throat> Probably like ten per is okay. Yeah, I think that's appropriate. 10 per. I wouldn't go lower than that. How do you do that? Do you have to actually take them to water or something and fill them up? Yeah. Okay, quick disclaimer. We here at the Were Witch Project are not gaming professionals or experts on the games we play. We attempt to learn things on the fly and try not to spoil ourselves with too much online information. Simply by playing V Rising since day one of the early access release, we've gained a plethora of knowledge. But we sometimes miss new addition to games, updates, and can make common mistakes for multitudes of different reasons. Common mistakes? You open the horse's inventory like three times. <laughs> Thank you, Harry. Uh, I agree. I'm completely at fault here. I just didn't see it. So what I'm attempting to say here is, if you're looking for professionals, you have come to the wrong place. You're telling me. <laughs> Shut up, Harry. You are getting ready to witness a pretty good example of this in action as the events unfolded. Without Gamma's fresh view on the situation and simply interacting with the horse to see the method of feeding them had changed from water skins to plant fiber, I, being the more stubborn or oblivious player of our group, could have easily turned this into a 20 to 30 minute debacle. This was pure player error on my part and is no way indicative of the very thorough system in place for guiding players throughout their adventures in Vardaron. Fart on Ron? Vardaron. Fart on Ron. Vardaron. Okay then, fart on your mom. If you have a well, that's normally how we do it, but I don't have one built yet. We've got a 97 brute. You will make a fine servant. Here? Will you let me do it here? I'm not getting the fill and, and team thing over at any of the waters. You have the stuff on your bar, on your hot bar? Yeah, the empty water skins are on my bar. Okay. And I'm clicking on the number associated with it. Okay. Not doing anything. It's not anything. doing anything. Problem solved. Here's a well. Not centered on that square, but... Yeah, it used to work at the water. Yeah, yeah. Before you just move up to the water's edge, hit whatever button it is that it's associated on your hot bar. And it goes bong, 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 bong. And it would just start working. Well, yep. why would they... Why would they change that? 
Is there some other way now that you do it? Keep your horse alive by supplying it with plant fiber. Oh, it's plant fiber now for them. Yeah, I was just getting ready to check. Plant fiber. For now, at least. Then what the fuck is the point behind the well, then, now? Oh, uh, not Maybe me. it's just like, um... At this point, um... Thematic. Just a decoration or something. Well, what did it take to build it, out of curiosity? Uh, 20 stone brick. Huh. It says a well filled with useless water. <laughs> yep, that's what it says. <laughs> well, I guess that's... It's pretty fucking straightforward. <laughs> this is fucking useless, you dumbasses. Well, is the water well useless then? Well, it, it is. Uh, do we have do we have a heart that we can throw over here? And what else do we need? We need four grave dust. Are we? We're getting ready nipples? to fight nipples. Here comes Let's nipples. You had so many rats chasing you, Blair. Yeah, I don't have my melee. Get it. Did you accidentally put too much in? Oh, fuck! <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna make sure that we don't. <laughs> Double nibbled! Bad nibbles. At first I was like, oh no, we, oh, we get like a nibble to hang out at our base. That'd be awesome. I saw him over here and I'm like, oh, that's cool. We get a little... From flesh to shadow. Nope. <laughs> he did not want to be friends. Harry, what are you doing? Shh! Don't say my name so loud! Why? Uh, that's Tabitha. Who? Nibbles the putrid rat? Y yes! Nibbles is her last name. I'm avoiding her. Oh boy, what have you done now? She super licked me on Slither. Super licked you? That's like a match or something you two know each other? Yes, but uh, we didn't match on purpose. 
uh, I had one too many cranberry and vodkas, and I accidentally uh, swiped right. Uh, I ended up at her place. It, it was disgusting. Uh, skipping the steamy deets, I woke up the next morning to her ten kids staring at us through a crack in the bedroom door. Ugh, they all look just like her. Oh, Harry, no. Yeah. Uh, now she won't stop BMing me. You mean DMing you? That's what I said, BMing me. So anyways, she keeps saying how much she loved my profile video and that my voice sounds like some singer chick named Alice. Anyways, I've been a little down on myself, so, uh, you know, one thing led to another. Uh, I haven't replied to any of her BMs. DMs? So you used her as a rebound? Buddy, that's just wrong. Well, uh, maybe if I had a little more exposure to my Slither profile, I, I wouldn't be so desperate. M maybe if I had an outlet to show my dating video, uh, I I'd get some more matches. Uh, I already knew where this was heading. Yes! Uh, thank you, witch. You're the best. I don't. I don't care what people say about you. Why do I feel like yeah, this yeah, is yeah, a right, bad idea? right there. No, wait. Yeah, yeah. K uh, uh, wait. I, I Click am. play. Uh, okay. Yep, that's the one. Sliver. So, welcome to Slither. Please state your name. Uh, my name is Harry. Hello, Harry. What are you looking for in a partner? Uh, I don't know. Uh, someone who is single? Great. And tell us a bit about yourself. Uh, 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 okay, well, well, like I said, my name is Harry, not Harold. I'm a first-time Slither user. Uh, I'm a little camera shy. Uh, sorry. It's okay. Go on. Well, uh, I guess uh, that. Well, I ain't evil. I'm just good looking. You can make me perspire. My snout will stop whooping. I'm a single brunette, half man, no longer an undead creature. I'd blow down your house to take pictures of your feet, sir. Put on my harness, round my main real tight. Run your creepy fingers up my furry spine. Leash my freaking sign. Dear mother of Dr. Frankenstein, please make it stop. Wait, 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 there's more. I like taking long walks. So maybe limber up, let you linger behind me, watch my furry butt. I'll learn a new trick if you give me a treat. I'll be panting like a dog left out in the heat. Well, you could be a gorgon, turn me to stone. If you'd like to meet me, just throw me a bone. Leash my Frankenstein. Favorite food is prosciutto, a movie psycho. Leash my Frankenstein. Why did you turn it off? I'd like to offer our most sincerest apologies to Mr. Cooper. The Werewitch Project is a massive fan of his hugely successful career, and we mean no disrespect to his music or person. Who's Mr. Cooper? And why would he be disrespected? I don't have the time nor the patience to explain to you why. Hey! Hey, we can work straight across if you guys want. But probably the bear, if, if we go do the bear, he's the closest. Yeah. The bear is, if memory serves, there if you can see my mark. There. Oh, really? Yeah, I think that, that does sound correct.
I'm taking off. We need to get this Hell's Clarion before we leave. Uh, spears. Oh, I didn't make a spear. That's alright. Yeah, you, you don't like that. Uh-uh. job guys hold you down Harry please tell me you did not have a fling with Cody a two uh, uh. I'm not even dealing with this at the moment. Thanks everyone for stopping by today. I'm Were Witch, and this has been Harry. If we've earned your like or you've subscribed today, we're absolutely grateful. If we didn't, maybe come by some other time. Give us another shot. Yeah, and you can leave us a comment or two below. Uh, I'll make sure the witch gets back with you ASAP. You know, you could answer some of them too. Maybe pull your weight around here? Oh, I've been pulling all kinds of weight over here. Did you see the size of Cody's ass? Thanks for watching. Oh, oh, oh yeah. Freaking Stagia.